Hi all, welcome to Salesforce in 5 minutes. In this video, we are going to check how to navigate to a record page in LWC. But before getting started, if you like my videos, please subscribe to this channel. So if you would have checked in the previous video, we had a form. We have created a form using record edit form. Now, Inside this record edit form, whenever I have to fill the details, whatever necessary details I have to fill up, and when I click on the create record, the 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 page used to be over here itself. It used to not navigate to the record page. So gradually in real world, what happens is we fill up the form. Once we fill up the form, we get automatically redirected to that particular record page that we have just created. So if 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 I would have created this Akshay test named uh, record. Uh, using that uh, using that lightning record edit form it should have got redirected to this page in real world but that's what not that was not happening in the previous video if it have checked it used to stay in the same page itself the record used to or the navigation used to not happen to that particular record page so in this video we are going to see how to fill up the form and after filling up the form after the user clicks on the create record how to navigate to that particular record page how to navigate automatically to the recently created account from this form so for that first i need to go to my lwc component before everything we have to understand what happens at the back end okay these are input fields whatever i have and this is my lightning button of named as create record now once user will click on this create record if you would have understood the life cycle of lwc from my previous video i will give the link of this video in my description what usually happens is first handle submit works so what happens is your forms first gets submitted now once the form is got submitted if there are no errors inside your form then it will go inside the handle success and if there are any kind of error inside your form we will go inside the handle error now what usually happens is that uh, as the record is getting created right as soon as you click on the create record if your record is successfully getting created and you're getting the id basically you are redirecting yourself to handle success so whatever navigation logic we have we are going to write inside handle success now before getting navigating or before navigating to any page we have to import few stuff right we have to import a navigation mixing so i'm going to import first the navigation mixing over here navigation yeah i have imported the navigation mixing this is used in order to navigate to any record page or anywhere we want to okay now once i have imported the navigation mixing i have to implement it as well so i'm going to extend the navigation mixing along with the lightning element so now i have uh, implement extend the navigation mixing along with the lightning element now I'm, i will be able to navigate to anywhere i want to the next thing is once the record is getting created successfully i want if i want to navigate i need the id of the record right before getting navigated to anywhere i need the particular id of that record to get the id of your particular account if the record was successfully created we can get it using event dot detail dot id so if my record is submitted and everything was fine if my record was created successfully inside handle success using event dot detail dot id i will be able to get the record id of that particular contact or whatever it might be so i'm going to just refresh this page once more and then i am going to fill up all the details within the form so this is let's say test one test one birth date 14th phone number something and level to secondary so now if i go and create the record first i went say went inside the inside submit and then after that i went inside inside success the reason is because the record was created successfully and if the record is created successfully i am able to get the particular record id of that account now as i have the record id of this account using event or detail dot id i need to redirect to that particular record id to do that what we can do is first i have to store that record id somewhere right i'm going to store it inside the rec id event or detail id and then i'm going to start writing the logic for navigation right so navigate 
and then function braces curly braces close it down and then we have to redirect to what so there are three ways we can redirect to one is to the record page second is to the home page or third is to the list view right so this is a list view we can redirect to the list view if you want to if you want to redirect to a particular record page this is what we will call it as a record page okay either we have to navigate to the list view either we have to navigate to a particular record page or either we, have, we can need, uh, navigate to the home page itself okay right now we have to navigate from the home page to the particular record page right so the type for which we have to redirect is a standard record page so i'm going to give type colon standard underscore record underscore underscore record page comma next i have to give attributes now attributes define where are we going to get redirected to like the record id and everything like that right and record id i'm going to give colon this rec id that i'm getting okay so what does this navigation is going to do navigation is going to navigate to us as to a record page but which record page the record page of the id that we are getting after the record was getting created over, over here so event.detail.id will give us the record of that contact that was successfully created inside the rec id and then we are redirecting to that particular record id so let's try it out now okay, i'm going to name it as for salesforce in five minutes subscribe going to give the birth date and also the phone number the level and you now if i go if i go and click on the create record first it will go inside inside submit then as there are no errors within this form it will go inside the handle success and inside handle success i'm getting using i'm getting the record id of that particularly created record using event.detail.id now once i have received that record id i'm using this dot navigation mix in dot navigate to navigate to a particular record page but which record page a record page having the record id as the above one okay so i'm going to go and click on the create record inside submit as i said inside success i've got the okay i think so it is not refreshed properly so i will perform a hard reload that might help us out yeah now again salesforce in five minutes subscribe you need to give the part date phone number level create record inside submit and after that okay why the alert is not going okay i will give the action name as well colon view we have to go to get to the view page that's the reason given the record page correctly right record page yeah correctly it is Five six test bot it phone number level create record yeah so now it's working fine so as you can see automatically from the home page I got redirected to the particular record page okay so in very simple words a recap what I did was on click of this button usually the record will get submitted now if there is a success or either error first the record gets submitted so handle submit is going to work now if the record is submitted after that either the record is created or either the record is not created if record is created then in that case we'll go inside the handle success and if we are inside if there is any error we'll go inside the handle error right now i have used navigation mixin in order to navigate to a particular record page or anywhere that i want to now inside handle success as the record is created to get that currently created record record id i have used event.detail.id 
I got it and I use this function in order to redirect to the record page. So this is how you redirect in LWC using navigation mixin. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to this channel.